and welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are having a great day. Today is going to be awesome. The winner of our GT500 is taking delivery all the way from Illinois and he's driving it home. He gave us a pretty good reaction on the phone, so I can't wait to see what he thinks of it when he actually sees it in person. Let's do it. If you did not see the upload where I trailered the GT500 to Whitmore with the Gladiator, it was pretty cool. Um, so the car is already down there and we're taking the 600. 810 miles, slowly getting to 1,000. I'm getting there, I'm doing my best. And it would appear as though we are low on fuel. Shocker. That's Chris inside. Hey, Dude. what's up, buddy? Golly. How you feeling? Am I here? Don't oh, pinch me. I feel like it's got to be real. It, it is now. <laughs> it is now. All week, no. Now I just turned it on. Now it's real. Yeah. What do you think? Does it sound good? It sounds awesome. Oh my God. Hold on. Let me let, let me park. I'm gonna come over there. All right. Chris is excited. I'm excited. This is my favorite part of the giveaways. Um, you know, building the car is fun, announcing it is fun, but the best part by far is, you know, when the winner shows up and we get to see their reaction when they get a brand new car and when we call, that's fun too. Oh my God. Oh my God. It's exciting. I'm not even getting anything and I get excited. I get all hyped up. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Beaver said you were tall. Last night. What did it really? Yeah, it yeah. must have been the excitement. Something like that. Well, Chris, nice to meet you, man. Great Number one, you. thanks so much for participating, and and I hope you'd like it so far. Thanks for doing this. Like it, I freaking love it. Absolutely. Uh, it, it, it's gonna be insane. I just, I can't wait. I'm so glad I'm driving. So <laughs> glad I get to just sit in it and just go. Yeah. So how how long is the drive from here to there? So uh, it's 11 hours. 11 hours of change. We're gonna do. We're gonna go halfway to Columbus. See my grandpa. Oh, that's not that bad. So, Guy. Okay. He's excited. I like uh, it. So we gotta go and stop and see him. And, uh, a little road trip out of it. And then go back up. Yeah. Cool. It's gonna be fantastic. Oh heck yeah, man! <laughs> is, is there still that party that's like this isn't real and like you know like you were saying? When we pulled it up, yeah, now it's real. Like that's now it's over the forehand. Awesome. Just, it, waiting and you're looking at the photos and you're like. Is it really? And then we're watching the videos and, and my wife's like, oh hey look, that's that's your car, and I'm like. Yeah. It's like, yeah, it's, it must be, it's super wow. weird. Yeah, that's my car. <laughs> I, just, I didn't expect it. You know I mean? I, I told myself I'm going to win. I told myself. Yeah, you said you were confident. It's going to happen. You know, I, I was going to happen. But isn't that something you kind of tell yourself, to psych yourself? And you're like, I, I'm going to win. I feel like it. Like, I mean, that's what I would do. Boom. I would tell myself I'm going to win. Yeah. And then it happened. You're like, wow. That is awesome. Well, Nate, thank you for bringing him up from BWI. Yeah, Nate. Really good care of me. <laughs> Really good You're in good hands I, with Nate. I had the uh, utmost pleasure of chatting with this guy and uh, his wife, Kay, so they were, they were amazing. And Heck yeah. Just seeing the genuine reaction on him, you know, it was just, it was, it was amazing. I'm uh, being all I'm trying to shield the GoPro yeah, from the no, horrible yeah. wind, so I'm, I'm holding it all I, weird. I, I'm still just trying to, it's like I can't look away. It's, it's, it's so cool, and in person, it's way... It's a sweet car, I'm not going to lie. Like, it, it, have you ever driven a... Uh, 2012 GT500. No. It's really good. Is it? Like really, really. You're gonna have a blast. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm ready to get in a row of yours. It, it, the coincidences are crazy, and I won't bore you with all of them. But with what I do for a trucking company, I actually okay. led a project 
um, design and to start to finish uh, where we wrapped one of our semi trucks. Really? In the same wrap brand as this that's on this really? American flag themed wrap. Just that is crazy. Year. So it, it's pretty cool. That is, that is awesome. I have to get some photos next to so you work for a trucking company. That's right. I do, I'm a Salesforce uh, system administrator. Okay. So I get to play around on the tech side of stuff. And then I also do digital marketing. So I get cool. to play around the social media side of stuff. So that's, is that how you found me maybe? Yeah. yeah, well, I'm, I'm, yeah big cool. Guy, big, like it. Um, and I have to be honest, I've always been a, a Chevy guy. I've always been a Corvette guy. Well, same. I but. mean, I, I, you just, you, you love them, right? And I, I was giving my father-in-law crow when he got the Mustang. Uh, secretly liking the sound and, and whatnot. Uh -huh. I got this. And, yeah, it's That's what you said. You're gonna flex yeah, on your father. I lie. We're, we're going there tomorrow. I That's our first stop. To, to take this here. After like, look who has the, the better Mustang now. Right? Just recently, last year, I actually led a design and the project management on this this uh, Mack truck, where we actually did a, a flag theme wrap, and it's got a, a saying on the side that says, "Thank you to all of our uh, veterans and that their families." Awesome. And uh, we actually gave it and presented it to a veteran uh, that works for our company and he drives it now. Um, it's, that is it's insane. Sick. So yeah. you are no stranger stranger to wraps. No, and it's the exact same same wrap. So, That's crazy. Uh, flag, same wrap company. How sick is that? Sign the papers, it's right? It's to start it, yeah. Oh, it's all over now. Oh boy. Oh boy. Bitch. Big chunkus. <laughs> You like it? I love it. You're gonna get horrible gas mileage. Uh, hey, what's the point? That's, that's, that's the point of having a, a car like this. It's exactly. Not, it's not about miles to the gallon, it's about miles to the gallon. Absolutely. And I'm gonna get a lot on the way home, that's for sure. <laughs> love it. Well, I think he definitely likes it, so that's good. Oh, that's butter. That clutch is, I love the clutch feel in this car. Well, a lot of people are like, oh, it's too heavy. No, it's got perfect so feedback. Nice. That's what you want. When you said left? Yeah, make a left. And then you got a nice straight road for a while. Perfect for Mustangs. And then there is one turn. <laughs> there it goes. <laughs> yeah, so I mean, it's a, it's a tail happy car, as I'm sure you can tell. That's not bad. The cool thing for me is like 2,800 miles. It's like a brand new, somehow it's like a brand new 2012. I don't know why I thought it was 28,000 miles. And then I, I've been rewatching the videos like crazy and I'm like, holy crap, that's 3,000 miles. Yeah, it's, it's like 2012. I don't know how Beaver found it. I guess some old guy had it. it it's a one owner car. And uh, yeah, I mean, it, well, I was expecting a much higher mileage one, um, but he came back with that and it was like, holy crap, 3,000 miles, not even 3,000. It's easy to drive. It is very for, easy. For, uh, you know, a car. And the cool thing is, if you want to go like crazy with it, you can do a lot and make this car really fast. A couple pulleys. Yeah, like you can really, uh, left here, you can really make this thing pretty gnarly. Chargers. Oh, you it's can't addictive. hear that. You can't hear that on the camera. It, it, it is loud. It is nice. It sounds real good. That's, oh, yeah. that's why I floor it all the time in this car. Oh, yeah. I'm dangerous in this car. I just floor it everywhere. That's why it's the giveaway. <laughs> no, but <laughs> <laughs> this is absolutely insane from a Chevy guy. I, so what do you have? I was looking at your Instagram. Do you have a Corvette now? No, uh, the yellow we, one. We rented that one. Okay. We down in Dallas. Okay. I just had so many photos from it. That I, I was gonna say. I, I just keep posting. And I saw posting. a bunch of pictures. I was yeah. like, I think this guy has a, a yellow Corvette. I yeah. Uh, so we went down to Dallas on our anniversary. Okay. And uh, it was just after the Mustang, you know, made its reared its head up with the, the father-in-law, and I'm like, you know what? I gotta get my wife on board with a sports car. I gotta have something as well to compete. And I'm like, yeah. I've always been a Chevy guy. I'm gonna. We're gonna rent a, a Corvette. We're gonna have a heck of a time, and uh, she, she liked going fast in it. That was for <laughs> sure. So uh, I think she's excited about this one. Oh, she's gonna love this yeah. then. Yeah. So your your father-in-law, he just got a Mustang recently. Yeah. Okay. It, it's, it's a uh, it's an uh, 18 5.0. Grandparents are over here, and they went for a ride in the, the Mustang the other day, and he said it was the fastest thing he's been in in a while. 
and uh, I said, you want to go for a ride when I get back? Just give me a couple days. <laughs> let's, go, let's go for a ride when I get back. I had to get it on, oh, you're gonna make a left here, oh, sorry. Okay. So we were just talking, wanted to get it on film though. So you got two t-shirts. I got, I got two t-shirts and two key tags. I got the, the coal bottle and nice. I got the Stang Life. Um, but it, it wasn't like I was going after the, the GT. I mean, I really like the key tags. I was like, I, I really like some new key tags. Well, thank you, I appreciate that. Yeah, and and uh, and then the, the, the Stang Life shirt came out. I'm like, that'd be a really cool shirt for my father-in-law. Uh, and so I bought it and, and got this one and it, it worked out well. And then like two weeks later you got the call. Uh, yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. I mean we try to um we try to make like all of our giveaways are themed. So we do like a whole different t-shirt line and key tag line. So we try to keep it like very interesting every time. So I'm glad to hear that you liked the merch too. Yeah. Not even thinking you were gonna win the car, just you thought the merch was cool. So yeah. that that means a lot because I designed it and Shane designed it, so <laughs> we appreciate it. <laughs> sorry man i'm so sorry that was terrible traffic was like a an hour and a half affair this is normally a 25 minute drive bam what are you doing dude so this is it this is the big facility that's bam well usually i don't come over at this time yeah <laughs> oh my goodness gracious look at this 488 beautiful this is from, uh, for a customer of McLaren Philadelphia, I believe. Wow, that is a beautiful car. Shane's a ZR1 over here, looking yeah. good. Dude, I like this. I love this car. The black is gnarly. That front end is like so sick. <laughs> That's crazy. Beautiful. Tour of Shane Designs, and now they are heading out back to Illinois. Nice little 11 hour road trip for them. Oh boy. It's sad to see it go. But I'm sure I'll be getting all kinds of pictures and everything on Instagram and from people seeing it. There she goes. Dude, that thing looks so good. I love it. That's it, another giveaway in the books. Mm, yeah, yeah. just carbon fiber, blow off valves. Mm. 600 wheel? Uh, yeah. That. Close to that. Yeah. Mm. So, you guys running? E85. Mexico. I think we're going to Mexico, I don't know. Can you get a chase here? Go. Yeah, you wanna come along? There we go. We'll chase vehicle, dude. All right, let's do it. We'll do the real, like, uh, like we're real, yeah, like we're actually doing some 1320 video. Man, really thought his Honda was coming. I'm sorry. <laughs>
Dude, what kind of witchcraft is that? You thought you had a problem. No, dude, that is so sick. Wasn't any fire? Oh my god, yeah. Okay. At the farm doing a little off-roading and wow, this has really grown up pretty bad. Oh man, I don't know. Do I really want to scratch up the brand new gladiator? Of course I do. Holy crap. I can't see anything. <laughs> Look at this, we're gonna drive right into the trees. <laughs> what? The gladiator is a beast and we're out. Okay, we are out. Brand new gladiator, folks. This is how you do it. We ain't afraid to get dirty. It's a swamp in here eventually though. That's the that's kind of scary part. I don't know where that is. And it could be any time. <laughs> We could, we could all of a sudden be in a swamp. I have no idea. There's the pond. About nothing in there. All right, we're out on this side now. Pretty cool. <laughs> hey, buddy. Hey. Is this the right way? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know where the paths are anymore, dude. Where did, how'd you, Troy said you went back here. I just went straight forward through there. Already like I already lost a mirror. <laughs> It's pretty, uh, it's pretty grown up, dude. Terrible. Oh, uh, my poor new Jeep. I don't know why I do this, but I, I swore that I wouldn't be afraid to off-road when I got it. You can't, you can't not off-road a Jeep. So you know what? It's like a band-aid. You might as well just do it all in one, in one go. He's bringing that gigantic land yacht through here. I love it. <laughs> He's backing up. Hold on. <laughs> Oh my God, he's making all kinds of noises in there. There he goes. Oh, he's in the mud now. Is that four wheel drive work? All right, well, let me, let me get back. Hold on. I was going to go down over this hill. There he goes. There he goes. There he goes. Man, that thing sounds good. It sounds really good, dude. All right, buddy. You know what time it is. I'm going to back it where? Your turn. Yeah, I know. I'm going to back it and see how deep it is. Because I want to come up over that hill. That wasn't my actual turn. I, I don't want everyone to think. That was a trial run. Can't catch out, dude. I don't have straps. I have a strap. <laughs> okay. Or are you gonna back up it? No, I just wanted to you should do that, back up it. Wow, that was boring. I was gonna say, if that thing makes it up, that, that's ridiculous. Here we go. Oh, the, oh, the trailer hitch. Oh, yeah. Hey, wait, wait. Let me go on the other side. I'm serious. It's dug into the mud. I'm hung up on it. Go forward, you chungus. Be the hitch, buddy. Let's uh, let's think this through, so you don't roll it. Almost made it. Not really. My trailer hit. The gladiator's just too long. If I had a little uh, two door, I think I'd go right up it no problem. But my trailer hitch is definitely like getting banged up for sure. 
And you know what? Let me. I'll just have Bobby pull me out backwards. Here, I'll get in the bed, and then you. I'll get in the bed. You just back up to it. Okay. All right, go ahead. Oh my God. Go back a little bit more. A little bit more. A little bit more. A little bit more. Okay. I think I can make it. No, you're good. I'll just put this down. Perfect. Okay, now. Don't move because I'm going to put the GoPros on the sidewall here. Crap. Ah. Take your socks off. Oh my god. <laughs> what? No wonder. It's just solid mud. You got a lot of slack. A lot of slack. Yep, keep going. It's working. Go ahead. Am I pulling? Yeah, you're pulling. Go ahead. Yep, yep. Okay, okay. Yeah, Bobby! Hold on, now I gotta get in this vehicle somehow. Oh, yeah! Heck yeah, that truck's actually really sick. I will get over that hill. Eventually. That's the new hill. This is the yeah, new hill. That's a new one to get over. Two. Yep. That's the hill. Oh, man. See, we were just saving the farm for wintertime all along. Yeah. People think we sold it, borrowed it. Yep. It's all right. No, we just had people gone. That was fun. That was fun. Yeah, we did go.